They say imitation is the sincerest form of flattery, except when someone steals your online profile. Only on 7 News, Marshall Zellinger is live finding copycats, Marshall. And this is Talia Haken's Twitter, and her message is clear. Spammers suck, because in the last week, she has found multiple accounts pretending to be her. This is myself and my husband and our dog. Talia Haken shows off her family across the top of her Twitter page. Problem is, this is not her Twitter page. How many in all have you found? 23. One week ago, Talia was alerted to one fake profile, tweeting her friends about the Jewish Sabbath, which starts on a Friday night. Every single Friday, right before Shabbat, we all tweet each other this list and say, Shabbat Shalom, guys. It was very odd that one got sent out on a Wednesday. While investigating this profile, Talia found her username, THDPR, being abused. So I just went through the keyboard from left to right and used my Twitter handle and added a letter. Um, and I found seven the first day and then seven the second day. She found even more using her real name and photo, but someone else's It username. was like looking at a picture of yourself in a picture of yourself in a picture. Talia thinks the fakes are automated bots creating profiles to sell. People are wanting to purchase usernames. They're wanting to purchase followers on Twitter to amp up their profile. None of the fake profiles appeared to write anything derogatory, simply copying and pasting Talia's real tweets. As violated as I felt when they stole the pictures of my dog, I can only imagine how violated I would feel when they stole pictures of my children. Talia has spent seven hours going through this process through Twitter, clicking through different options of saying that someone is pretending to be her, ultimately getting to a screen where she has to provide personal information, ultimately providing Twitter even a copy of her driver's license. So far, she's been successful eliminating 14 of 23 fake Talias. Reporting live, Marshall Zellinger, 7 News.